This is a little song I call the Subprime Mortgage Blues. I'm gonna tell you all a story that is a little sad about what happened to the credit market when real estate went bad. This may give you a big headache. You might need another pillow. Unless you've got millions in the bank, like Angelo Mazzillo. His company is countrywide. This may come as a shock. He says his company is fine, but he keeps on selling stock. It began when Alan Greenspan cut rates to get us out of trouble as the economy was threatened by that big internet bubble. Some say Greenspan engineered a landing that was soft, but as an unintended consequence, real estate took off. Bankers started to make loans that fundamentally were not sound. Yeah, go ahead, lie about your income. We don't need no money down. They packaged up these loans with ribbons sold them off, what can I say? First they paid SMP and Moody's for their ratings, AAA. Folks could barely make the payment with a teaser rate quite low. And when that teaser rate adjusted up, man, that was a fatal blow. Oh, this subprime mortgage thing's a mess. Have you heard the news? The US dollar, it is worthless. I got the Ben Burn Nike Blues. This buyer had a problem that was bigger than a mouse. The banker said, hey, make that payment. The buyer said, come take the house. Bankers do not like to hear that. Yes, the buyer had some clout. So the bank turned to the government and said, please bail us out. Some said, this is a bigger problem. Paulson said they are insane. This really is not a big issue. It's extremely well contained. The truth always comes out, and here it started to unfold. Few companies could borrow money. Commercial paper would not roll. So you better invest carefully. Do your homework. Pray for luck. You could end up in a money market fund that breaks a buck. The market went down every day from the time the bell would ring until Friday afternoon when Kramer said, they know nothing. But it isn't quite that easy. If we could only pull a lever to make the price of real estate just go straight up forever. Now the economy's not perfect. It needs help now and again. So look who's coming to the rescue. Yes, it's Helicopter Ben. Oh, this so prime mortgage thing's a mess. Have you heard the news? Helicopter Ben coming to the rescue. The U.S. dollar, it is worthless. I got the Ben Burr Nike Blues. I am here, Ben screamed to everyone. This mortgage thing's a mess. But have no fear, my Wall Street friends. I have got a printing press. As he started printing more and more, 
folks could not believe their eyes. This Bernanke, he prints money like Paris Hilton goes through guys. Be grateful as Christmas approaches and you sing a Christmas carol. Gas will be five bucks a gallon, oil a hundred dollars a barrel. So now you pay more for everything, not a little more, a lot. But rest assured, each banker keeps his beach house and his yacht. We all know that Ben Bernanke would never throw those guys a curve. This year those guys will once again make 20 times what they deserve. And when it's time to pay the piper, and believe me, that day will come, these guys will quickly leave the business having saved ungodly sums. That's not the end of this sad story. Will it end? Oh yes it will. When we remember Chinese leaders on a US dollar bill. So invest your money wisely. Pay attention now. You must. Someday the front side of a bus will read 